what's up, what's up, everybody? Today is going to be a very different day, a very different vlog for this channel, and first time for itong gagawin because I will now be getting my first sahod in YouTube, and I am now here in Valencia City, Kidman, and I'll now be going to Western Union in Besa. See you guys. Ah, <laughs> 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 This is happening right now. So this is my first ever YouTube sahod. OMG. So I will try my best to speak in English as much as possible because I'm not comfortable with uh, speaking in Tagalog. Yes. Anyways, um, going back to the history where I when I started YouTube, it was I think the year 2013 when some of my students submitted a video about math. And then I uploaded it on YouTube. Yeah. But it was not followed until um, I think it was the year 2016 when I started uploading 
videos of my students uh, in some of the contests that we had in school. So I am uh, the ones usually uploading those videos and I haven't realized it before and I actually don't know at first that you can actually earn money in YouTube. Since then, um, I started, yes, but I actually um, couldn't uh, believe that you really are earning until now that I am already earning money in YouTube. And sa naalala ko, you can uh, monetize your YouTube channel if meron ka ng 10,000 views. That was before uh, February 2018. So that is why um, I was able to monetize my YouTube channel way back November 2017. But it was cut short in February 2018 because um, YouTube um, gave another uh, minimum so and guidelines on when you could monetize your channel. So they made it to from 10,000 views, they made it to um, 1,000 subscribers. You should have at least 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 hours of watch time. Yeah, and during that time, I was not able to reach that one. So my channel stopped monetizing in March and it resumed on December because I was able to reach already the uh, 1,000 subscribers back then and um, yeah, 4,000 hours of watch time. So since December 2018, I'm already monetizing, but it's a little only. Yes. So um, how did I get my payment? So um, you can actually see what you are earning online. So makikita mo siya sa sa YouTube channel mo sa YouTube Studio. Kung magkano yung uh, income mo in a specific period of time. So walang problema don. But I am not really sure kung pera ba talaga yon until now na nakuha ko na. So, uh, yung makikita mo doon, yung money is in, um, it's I think in US dollars. Yes, but you can convert it in peso. Yes, so by the way guys, yung na income ko ngayon, yung nakuha ko is as of August 2019. I got a, a bit busy lately, so that is why hindi ko na siya nakita na umabot na pala sa threshold. So, and the reason why I was not able to mon uh, get my sahod before because hindi pa siya umabot ng 100 US dollars. So, yun kasi yung minimum threshold para makapag-monetize ka sa YouTube. Diba ka? What else? Um, yes, so, um, it was also during this year, I think that was April, when um, YouTube sent a pin. So... You need to reach at least ten dollars, bago ka uh, bago ka bigyan ni YouTube ng pin. So yung pin, uh, galing yan sa Google, ipapadala yan sa yo sa yung address. Tapos kailangan mo siyang i-input. I don't know kung how long, basta you just have to input it para pwede ka nang magmonetize ng channel mo, ba? So yun nga. Umabot na siya ng, ano, ng 100 US dollars and that's roughly I think 5,000 pesos. So dahil doon, um, parang kinonvert na siya ni, ni Google AdSense ng, uh, into money na pwede mo nang kunin sa Western Union kasi yun yung pinili ko na um, payment option. So pwede sa bank. Pero sa mga nakikita ko sa mga video sa YouTube na mga Pinoy na kumukuha ng kanilang sahod, they usually get it in Western Union. Yes. So, I was able to print this payment receipt. And um, the only things that you need to do is dapat meron kang government issued ID. So, pwede passport, driver's license, uh, probably PRC ID. And since meron ako nun, no problem. And, of course, you should, uh, yung amount, alam na nila yon. And the most important number na dapat meron kang kopya is yung money transfer control number. So it's, I think, a 10-digit number. And, yon na, I'm so um, um, hesitant kung pera pa talaga ito. 
So, nung pumunta na ako ng Western Union, I was actually um, afraid na baka hindi pwede. But, tinanggap naman ng teller. Tapos, gusto ko yung Western Union sa Gaisano Mall kasi mabait yung teller. Anyways, um, yeah, uh, after waiting for a few minutes, nakuha ko na siya. OMG. So, um, again, sa sinabi ko kanina, kailangan mong maabot yung 100 US dollars na threshold bago ka i-pay out ng YouTube. And you have the option actually kung mag uh, yung minimum. So, pwede mo siyang iset na 200 yung minimum na 200 US dollars yung minimum na payout. Pwede din uh, basta pwede mo siyang i-customize. And kapag i-convert mo siya sa peso, it's 5351.05. In US dollar, it is 104.88 or diba bang ka? Amazing. Yes. So you can really earn money in YouTube. And um, speaking of uh, my videos, one of my, uh, I think that my most viewed video is I think about zip grade. Yes. So I'm so thankful to that video because I think it has reached already 27,000 views. I think it's already 28,000 now. And it's um, my most watched video on YouTube. It was also the video which earned the most. Kasi makikita mo sa YouTube analytics kung magkano yung na-earn na income ng bawat uh, video mo. Next to ZipGrid videos is yung next na top earner ko na videos uh, ay yung mga ano ko, travel videos. So yung paano ka mag, uh, uh, paano ka uh, mo gagamitin yung EasyLink card ng Singapore. So top videos ko yun. Yes. And syempre, meron din, marami din akong viewer dun sa video namin dito sa school. Yes. So, thank you so much for tuning in. And stay tuned for more updates. Since may na-receive ako na blessing, I will be sharing it to you. So, probably in a form of load. Yes. So, stay tuned. So, I will be announcing when I will be um, doing a live video. And whoever comments their number, so, bibigyan ko ng probably 50 pesos load. Thanks for watching. Bye!